For scientists and astronomers, Mars has always been the most mysterious of the red planets. They had all been studying it more closely to learn more about the planet. In order to accomplish this, NASA Mars 2020 sent the Perseverance rover to the planet. While looking for former lives, the rover recently claimed to have made some exciting discoveries. Perseverance travelled to the Delta for its primary research over the course of more than a year. When Perseverance eventually reached the Delta in April 2022, that's when researchers finally discovered what they were looking for. Two pairs of cores from various types of sedimentary rock that make up the Delta's margin have been collected by the rover in recent months. One pair is from the Skinner Ridge rock outcrop, which is composed of fine-grained sandstone and is a common form of rock on Earth. The Skinner Ridge cores seem light-coloured and studded with spherical grains of black material when viewed up close in Perseverance sample tubes. These darker grains most likely came from locations that are hundreds of kilometres away and were transported by an old river that previously flowed into Jezero. Therefore, examining the grains could provide information about the past of remote regions of Mars. The other recent pairs of cores were taken from Wildcat Ridge, which is only 20 metres away from Skinner Ridge. These samples have a paler colour and are more uniform. Even more fine-grained than the Skinner Ridge cores, they appear to be mudstone. The rock is more likely to have fossilised remains if the grains are finer. Small grains on Earth frequently settle out in low-energy areas like the bottom of ponds where they can preserve settling living forms like decomposing microbes. Adding to the buzz surrounding the newly discovered sample, Perseverance acquired the rock samples from an ancient delta in Mars's Jezero crater, where a river had previously left behind layers of sediment and perhaps other material. Additionally, researchers discovered the chemical compound of Wildcat Ridge, the rover ground a 5 cm wide circle into the rock to reveal its internal texture next to the locations where Perseverance dug its two cores. The robotic arm of the rover was then extended to examine the rock's mineralogy. According to planetary scientist Sunanda Sharma of the Jet Propulsion Laboratory, it turned out to be more organically rich than any other area Perseverance has so far explored. Additionally, the organics appear to be concentrated more heavily in regions that are also abundant in sulfate minerals, which may include traces of life. This implies that as the lake which formerly filled Jezero evaporated, organics and sulfate minerals were concentrated. On Earth, river deltas frequently support an abundance of life. These cores are most likely NASA's greatest opportunity to discover any life that may have ever existed in Jezero. Having the cores is incredible. If researchers ever hope to find the answers to all the unanswered questions about past life on the Red Planet, these calls will be picked up by other spacecraft that NASA and the European Space Agency plan to send to Jezero in the upcoming years and brought back to Earth, where scientists will analyse them using cutting-edge laboratory procedures. The first Mars samples to ever be retrieved are anticipated to arrive no earlier than 2033. Perseverance has already advanced to a different region that is already investigated called Enchanted Lake. There, efforts will be made to gather some of the debris that is lying around on the Martian surface as well as another set of samples of fine-grained rock. Let's see what's next to discover on the alien planet, Mars.